Up next, I'm going to be talking about John Digweed. You may not have heard of him. He's, I don't think, from this country, from the United States. He's from a different country. Um, he began DJing when he was very young. He was 15 when he started getting really into the music. In 1993, he had a breakthrough um, in a renaissance club in Mansfield. Um, he's known for promoting um, progressive households, like the when dubstep and the household sounds became popular. Um, in Europe and North America, in like the late 1990s and early 2000s, um, he started a record label called Bedrock, which was helping him to promote his music and helping him to further promote his music and other people that he knew that were trying to get their music out there. Um, I really liked his music. It's calm. It's not too out there. He doesn't sing. It's just like dubstep, um, techno. It's just the beats that he has. Nothing too drastic. Um, it's very calm, very soothing. My daughter likes listening to him. Um, she was listening to Awakening. So maybe go to YouTube and check that out. Um, very interesting. I just recently started getting into the whole dubstep, techno, house music. So I'm new to it. But the songs that I've heard I really, really, really liked. So you guys should totally check out him. His name again is John Digweed. D-I-G-W-E-E-D. He does have a um, family that are very popular. Um, they're not music. I think his uncle or a cousin of his is into like the shooting. He's a really good shooter. He does like tournaments and stuff. So um, his name is his last name is well known. Like I said, he's not from here. Everything started in Europe and came to North America and stuff. So he's definitely worth a shot. I give him three or four stars for his music. I really liked it. My daughter liked it a lot as well. So that's my video for John Digweed tonight. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.